I'm adapting a third, fourth century text about Alexander the Great into a graphic novel. My project is a political science project that's designed to assess whether or not private prisons have a profit-driven incentive to incarcerate people. I'm looking at the relationship between um, nicotine exposure to attraction to gambling-like cues in rodents. One of the uh, in most important things about Capstone's experiences today at Wesleyan is the enormous variety of possibilities open to students. Not just writing a scholarly uh, paper or a monograph, it really includes creative practice uh, in the arts and it includes performance. Because I've loved graphic novels and comics my whole life, but also visual arts and writing and storytelling, this really feels like the culmination of things I've been preparing for since I was a little kid. I was my junior spring called Racial and Ethnic Politics with Yamil Velez, and um, I was just introduced to the whole idea of the prison industrial complex in that class. So I wrote my final paper. He um, liked the paper a lot, and he emailed me and said, this could become a publishable paper. Let's start more next semester. So I jumped on that. I thought that sounded like something I should follow up on. The scholar-teacher model at Westing works so well because as a student, you really feel like your teachers are not just repeating to you things they've heard. They're actually working with you on subject areas in which they are intimately involved and sometimes actually expanding the borders of their own fields. So working with Professor Robinson has been a really great experience uh, because it allowed me to develop a personal relationship with a professor. Of course, you know, Dr. Robinson and I um, work on many academic levels, but he's also there as just a general mentor that helps me with preparing for a career. In research. It's been an amazing relationship. We have a similar sense of humor and the same kind of passion for historical research and research in general, so we connect over that. But I also know that as I tackle this enormous project, he's there for moral support too. After I graduated was then, I plan on going to graduate school. I'll be going to UCLA uh, to study political science in their PhD program. The writing sample of this project was the writing sample I used to apply to graduate school, so it basically got me into graduate school. I feel fortunate to have something where I think the story is worth telling on its own, but I also can take it beyond Wesleyan. I can see it being adapted into other media, for example, a film or a TV show, but also as proof of my skills as a graphic novelist. Because if I ever want to tell another story, it's impressive to say, well, look, here's what I can do in a year. Give me two years and I'll do better. I think it's great to be able to apply learning from and knowledge from several different places. And my thesis work is like the big final project of all of that. Um, so it's nice to be able to leave Wesleyan with an experiment that kind of showcases all that I've done over my years here. It's one thing to do somebody else's assignment, but to do your own project that you care about and that you get other people to be interested in, that's a very powerful thing.